views and subscribe and support us. What are we now going? Yeah, man, you know, so I come across information at company of Jamaica tell them. Employ that. Then you can't record the company because they're fat. Two individuals, one fat and one have a little illness. Nothing too serious. Maybe um person have to take insulin. Person have to take insulin. Or diabetic or diabetic or diabetes or something, I'm not sure but some insulin they will take. And the owner for the company will the staff and tell them so you can't work for the company no more because you're fat. And how can I tell employee that they cannot work for you no more because they're fat? That's a discrimination. That's like you yeah, tell the parents, say, look here, you're black. I'm not like you. You see me? That's straight out. That's how me put in my own context. I can tell us, I tell the person, yo, yo watch it now. I'm a racist person, so I know why I'm a company for no longer. And uh, if it was into a, a foreign country, maybe in the USA, you see me? Maybe if in the USA or any other country, England or maybe, um, they could take them to court and maybe win them or, you see me, come down with one of them. History following up. Uh, you cannot discriminate people in another country. Yes, you see, we get so. But only in Jamaica, we have them privilege as an employer. You have, have, the, have the privilege, can my employer say, yo, you can't work for me no more because you're fat and you're sick. And the person who well, take the insulin so, should know, or supposed to know. The doctor supposed to explain to them how they take them insulin. Two times for the day, one in the morning, and when I go home, Maybe in the evening when you're going to be that night, you can't take it or whatever. I don't know how that works, so I can't fully explain that to you guys. You understand? Yeah, man, some of us are blessed to know, man. Welcome to the topic when you're not showing him to it, man. Just give thanks. I give the creator thanks. I'm blessed up. I'm big him up. I don't know so I'm not left out the creator, though. I continue the topic. So, yeah, so, I mean, that is totally unacceptable. And if we have a law in our country for, that, for them kind of something there, I don't think these people to continue to discriminate them workers because it's a going out there and a plenty of company where we don't know. Boss not like a record because in black or she black. You see me? Only for brown, you can you can work with the company or you, them favor um, a brown person than a black person more and treat the brown one more than the black person. You see me? The black person get less treatment and the one who have the high color get more treatment, they get better benefit. They maybe get a higher incentive, higher bonus at Christmas time. They get position. You name it. You see me? That, that's a go in our country right now as me at all. And I look into the whole thing and I say, oh, in every area, take it in every aspect of life. Rules, like rules not set for um, for everybody, it's set hunger for some people. It's like it's set hunger for the poor. You see me? And if you even report this situation, you're not getting no justice. In Jamaica, in Jamaica right now, poor people don't get justice, you know. But no one say I know found to disagree with me upon this, but poor people don't get justice, justice in a Jamaica. And maybe um, overseas or a foreign country. You can't be able to get justice because them people are um, strict. When you come on to justice, they're strict. But Jamaica, you can't do anything and get away with it. When I have, when I have rules, stand out for the, for the high society people, for the rich, for the upper class. And for the poor man, you have rules. You understand me? And the poor man alone, so you can't go to prison, can't, can't face the penalty. When the high society people do anything, they can get away with it, scratch free. And it erases out, out, it erases out of the law book, it erases from the court, it erases from the police station, it document, dash your case, dash your, them now no strong evidence, uh, you name it. But when you come to the poor man now, them find everything against the poor man and pan the poor man, pin things from the poor man where the poor man you know about. You understand me? So, I can't believe, say, yo, when we hear the story, I say, oh, like, really? You yeah, tell somebody, say, them can't work at your company because they're fat. When you employ the person, you never know that so the person is fat. 
or the person don't fit for the job or the person don't look as how you want your staff them to look because you have some people set them staff and say, I watch them. I pay brown people me hire you know. I not hire no black people in my company, man. I pay brown people. And if you do, I'm for, for hire on that color skin person in your company. You're gonna mistreat the person, you're gonna pressure that person to do more work than where the other um, brown person for do at your company. Because you don't like that black um, the black individual or the dark individual. You're gonna pressure you're gonna pressure, put apply more pressure upon the individual because he's black. Or she black, so yo. You go work hard to the T. You go work him to the T. That that should never be the case in our country. In our country, Jamaica. Our country too small for our favorites in our country and we see the world divided already. We see it, it are going right in front of our eyes for media every day. You see me? So we shouldn't have this in our country because you are fat and you are sick. You see me? I don't know if you have laugh in Jamaica because I do research and I don't see no laugh here. So if the person if you got report it, not now come out of it because there are no law feet in, in a Jamaica. You see me? So that is just yo no say yo. They send them to individual because of their looks. You see me? Them them fat, them sick. So right there, so you stop to infant bread. You cut off honest income to that individual. So what about at the time when you send on the person or when the company send on the, the person? That was your own source of living. Just to get me about eight thousand dollar, nine thousand dollar a week, or a fortnight, or fifteen or twelve thousand dollar a fortnight. And that twelve thousand dollars still can about at, at at the same time, yeah, we have to give thanks for that because it's better than for go up on the street for a kind of man, for go thief, for go the scamming. Cause when you do scamming, police are come for put them and find them and lock you up them and give some long them long run. So it's better than nothing. You see me? I mean, I'd say a person will settle for twelve thousand dollars a week. But you can go and work and get a twelve thousand or eight thousand dollars a week or a fortnight until you set yourself. Don't use the word until better comes. Until me set myself or the person set themselves because if you don't put foot forward in life, you say yo, you'll go at it, you'll you'll you achieve a goal, you'll achieve a dream where you want. Nobody I care not come put your foot just so. If somebody even give you something, they, they might want something in return. You have to do grant them a favor. Some either the easy way or the other, but you have to grant them a favor. So get that low income, it's better than if you go out there. You see me, I have a bigger man. Can you know, say, right nowadays things are get hard, so nobody not to give you nothing right, you know. So it's good when a man work and earn him honest bread, him honest living. But people, if you let me know one thing about this um, situation, you see me? Let me see on the comment in the, in the comment section. If you don't want to comment, when you drop on the flag, which country you come from, then you can recognize and answer say, yo, thanks for the support. You see me? I give them the feedback on this one thing about this situation because, in, in my belief, I want me to see this thing. They don't have to lose them work because how them look. And nobody calls sickness upon themselves. You know. Things do happen to us when we, 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 we want to ask for. You see me? I just, we have a try to do best. If we have illness, we got a doctor, we get treatment feed. Or, you see me? Try to keep strong and try, or try to live healthy. But I don't believe in you know, employer for, employer for sending an employee because they are sick or they are fat. It's not like your sickness or severe sickness where you can't control it or you don't have treatment. The person go to the doctor and doctor and tell him how to deal with their situation, how to handle whatever, when to take whatever. But come on, man. You can't fire people because they are sick or they are fat. But if there is a rule for it, or there's a law feed, that's let me know. Pin it in the comment section so we can read read about it and do my own research so we can understand this thing fully. But as all me understand right now, we don't have that in a Jamaica. Only in a foreign country, me know you can't discriminate nobody in a foreign country because I don't think you can look for a, a thick woman in America and tell her she's fat. Else, 
you violated this. I don't think, even out here, I don't think if you see a thick woman or a fat woman as a classifier, a fat girl, when you really see her like her, she just say, hey, fatty. I don't think she'll reply to you because you're this, sir. And you have some people, they are very, very sensitive when they say certain words to them. You understand me? Man sensitive and woman sensitive. You have some people overall that say you cannot say certain words to certain people. You have to pick and choose and be careful where you say some people, you know, because some people easily get offended just by how you talk to them. By, by the words they use. You understand? Even man or woman leave a house. If you say some things to your wife or to your girlfriend or to your boyfriend or to your husband, you offend him or you're not even know so you offend him. So, saying this, to saying that, we have to just pick, pick, and, pick and choose the words what to say to other individuals and not try to hurt nobody's feelings because we are all human and we don't make ourselves. We never tell ourselves that we won't get fat or we won't get slim because you have plenty of people out there now, right now, female and male. When when maga are slim, we want to get fat. And if someone looks and says, hey, maga girl, you're a maga boy, they might feel offended. You understand? So, we could just love each other, support each other. You see me? And I always done a video with this. Try to be blessed. Why must I try to be blessed? Right, I'm glad I don't ask or not wonder. Meaning, try to help others. You see me? If you can give a man a night dinner or you can buy something to somebody if you, if you eat or you bless a man with something, the blessing will come back to you. You see me? It will come back to your family. It will pass on to your generation family. So right there and then, your, your family blessed because you, 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 you do something great for somebody. You don't know why some people are blessed because they don't give people nothing. Them are not clean. They are all for themselves. That's why I say some, ki some kids, some family members suffer because yeah, some people not, not do good. They not do good for nobody. Give us a money come ask you for a night dinner, beg your bus, or beg your lunch. Them, them, them say they don't have it. If some people are driving on the road, or some people are beg, them say they don't have it. If them say food, I prefer to take the money, buy the food, give them for them eat, but I nah give them money. Yeah, I will buy the food. When me buy the food give you, throw it away, I sell it if you want after, but me I take the money buy it. As long as I can afford it, me I take the money buy the food give you. So goodness can follow me, my son and my family. That's why I'm saying try to be blessed. Yeah man, and so guidance, peace, I'm out. As remember, to just give the video a thumbs up. Like, share and comment the video. I'm not really, I got hard, but I don't know, so yo, it take time for everything, you see man, it take time for growth. I'm not rush it. Whatever I mess up in another, another video, if it makes sense, just, just give me a thumbs up in the comment section if you, if you know what to type. Or you press the thumbs up or you drop a flag. That's so simple. So bless, peace, guidance, and out. I always remember, keep a relationship with the Creator. I'm out.